Hello, I'm Urania, the Greek muse of astronomy, and I'd like to help you with your revision of the astrophysics option in the AQA A level physics specification. You may also find the following book useful. The A level astrophysics workbook by Dr. G.K. Fox, exclusively available in the Kindle store. It also happens to have a picture of me on the front. In this video I will review the chromatic aberration of a lens. Chromatic aberration occurs in glass lenses because, when white light passes through the glass, the different wavelengths travel at slightly different speeds, and hence, by Snell's law, they refract by different amounts. You should recall that red light is refracted the least. Recalling how to draw chromatic aberration for a convex lens is a map from memory technique. We begin by drawing the convex lens, and then we draw the optical axis and principal axis. We will start with red light. We draw two rays parallel to the principal axis, until they reach the optical axis. We then draw the two rays, crossing the principal axis, some distance from the lens. We repeat the same process for light with a shorter wavelength. Blue light is often used, but it could be any other color. I have chosen violet, because it has the shortest wavelength in the visible range. Violet light comes to focus, closer to the lens, than red light. Finally we make sure that arrows have been used to indicate the direction of the light and that the diagram is correctly labeled. In summary, chromatic aberration occurs due to refraction, and for a converging lens, the shorter the wavelength, the closer the focal point is to the lens. Thank you for watching.